Hey guys, Gobers from Gobin here, here to show you a package I got today from JoJo's Hobby and stuff. It is their Abel Quao box. Abel Quao, I hope I'm saying that right. It is a loot box that you can get from them. It's $30, I think it's plus $9 shipping now, flat rate. And it can have a high grade and some other parts all the way up to, I think if you're lucky, a master grade. And I picked it up from Shin from JoJo Hobby and stuff. I got two of them. One is for me, one's for my father. And I think this is both of them in the same bin. So, I want to see what I got, as well as my dad. So I want to share with you, see what I got. Open my boxes weirdly. Man, that trash truck outside. Try not to go too deep just in case. Don't want to damage my merchandise here. Alright. Oh, we got bubble wrap. Oh, I see. I see some Kotobukiya. I am ready. Alright. One is for my father and one is for me. This is two boxes in one. Yo! Yo! Oh, that's cool. Alright. He sent a letter. I think this is my shipping notice. Yes. He, he sent a letter. I'm going to read this letter. Hi Lee, thank you for your purchase. We hope the packaging ran well and safe and manner. Please let us know if there's anything any issue. Yo, Shin, my man. You dude are awesome. So he also sent us some Kotobukiya pieces. This is a shield. And this is oh ooh. That's like a combination sword. Modeling support goods number six. It looks like it's a two-type sword. This is modeling support goods number 35. It's a shield. That could actually put, go pretty good. And then he also sent... Oh, he sent two swords. Okay, cool. Modeling support goods number 6. Oh! He sent a Gundam marker, too. Yo, is that... Uh, this is black. Yeah, this is GMO2... Or, was it? GMO1 200 black. Yo! Let's see two things of MSG parts. I think this is everything. Yeah, empty box. So, a nice packaged real gray Justice Gundam and a nice packaged Freedom Gundam. So, he didn't say who they each was for. And I'm not picky per se. And neither is my father. So I want to, for anyone that cares, um, I want to see if you guys can leave it in the description, or not description, um, comment section, who gets what kit. If I get this kit, or I get this kit, my dad gets this kit, or then my dad gets this kit. I don't think my dad will care either way about the modeling support kits himself, but I'll say the same thing for you guys. I'll say we both get a sword, but uh, you guys pick who gets the uh, shield. I want to say thank you, Shin. I was not expecting real grades. I was honestly expecting high grades. <laughs> I'm actually quite excited about this. This is uh, Gorbers from Gorbin Den. Actually, no, not, uh, not yet. Not yet. I'm going to show off the sides of the box. So this is the Freedom Gundam. You have like a full setup in a frame. You just choose like the runners. How you cut off the frame off the runners. The opening cockpit. Some ab crunches and some wing movement. Looks like stickers. Now from what I've heard, these real grade stickers on the arms here... Uh, they're like on the uh, elbow joints 
they are not necessarily the best for going on, but you also have like uh, ET and uh, warning decals. And then you got some poses. This is like him firing all the cannons with the sword, the back pose. And if I get the camera to focus. Trying to focus on that R. So you got like, oh, yeah, no, it doesn't want to focus. Silly camera. But you got like the head, looks like the backpack with the gun, the handle of the gun, fingers, the manipulator for hands and the elbow. Yep. And then it has, one sec part separation at the knee and I think that's the calf for this one then there's the Justice Gundam head it shows off the inner frame your backpack it shows the Justice riding the Gundam I actually have a Master Grade Justice that I have to build and then I have another one coming in that's the clear version can you tell I like the Justice it's got the same gold bits that are on the elbows or the inner joints of the elbow as well as the backpack but it's showing up it has peg points for the feet so he can do this pose here uh decals and then it's snapped up i don't think this has any decals on it no it's snapped up with decals on this photo Let's see if i can get it to focus you can see a little bit of the decals and then posing. So you see that pose with the glider on the backpack, using twin swords, and then him holding that out. Shows you the head, the chest, the sides. If the camera wants to focus all the time. It's always my camera beam effect parts separation at the leg some of the arm separation manipulators in the hands Let's see if i can get that pose in there of course it doesn't want to go nope but you can see him standing on there that's the pose i've always liked about the justice and then all of the rail grade boxes are black on the bottom we have, I got two of these. It's a sword and bigger sword combination. The assembly instructions are on the back of the box. So you have, oh no. Okay, so you have a sword, a side sword, and then a gun. Oh, so this is like a buster sword type thing. So you can go from full sword, you break it down, so there's a sword outside of a sword. So you have the main sword and that. Then you break down even further and you get two swords and a gun. I like that. That'd be pretty cool to see on the Justice. Because we have two of these, I'm just going to show off this. So you have the shield, or a beam effect shield. So you have showing off the build. It doesn't actually show up. Aww. But it shows the type of different effects the shield can have. So you have that, that, that. So you can have a full shield or you can have what this guy has, what this guy has where it's like a blast of energy off your wrist. I think that's pretty cool. Yes. I, um, I really do like this. I think I will. It's always like a nice touch. Getting a thank you letter. You never see that. So I think I'm going to keep on picking these up I would like to say thank you for anyone that watches and then thank you to Shin for hooking my pop and I up with some pretty cool real grades I did not expect the twin combo here freaking what is it Kira and I can't remember this guy's name because I didn't like him Atherin? I think it's Atherin. Is there an English? And that just tells me about that. Yeah, I think it's Atherin. I could be very wrong. Correct me in the description or in the comments if I am. 
I want to say thank you. I hope you all have a nice and wonderful day and have a good one. And if you can, look at uh, JoJo Hobby Shop. I'll put a link in the description. I'm getting it right this time. Um, he's got a nice shop. The guy's nice. Easy to chat with. Hooks you up. Obviously. Um, yeah, overall, he's just a nice guy to work with. I hope you all have a nice day and or night, depending on what time you're watching this, and over in the future in the past. This, if anyone was curious about, was February's box. I have, I picked up one box in March, and I have to pick up April's next. But there's also, um, what is the word I'm looking for? There's a box every month for thing, but his boxes usually sell out super quick. So if you want to pick one up, keep a lookout for uh, his site. You can get a whole bunch of different stuff, even P Bandai stuff. So, yeah, I hope you all have a nice and wonderful day. I've said this twice now. Have a good one. Bye.